Hey, I'm Hester and you are watching Handmade Home. Little Kiki and I have joined up at Children's Salon to show you how to make this extremely cute floral bunny ears. To make the floral bunny ears, you're gonna need a hairband, rope around one meter, artificial flowers, a glue gun, needle and thread, craft wire, scissors and pliers. You're gonna start with your rope, you're gonna shape it around your hairband into the ears you like. I'm making bunny ears, but if you'd rather be a mouse or a fox, you can of course use those ear shapes as well. And you're gonna cut your rope to fit. Push the craft wire through the middle of the rope. If your rope is a nice loose weave, it'll make it a lot easier because it's a bit of a fiddly job. Sometimes the wire will go through out of the side of the rope. Just push it through and keep going. If the end of the rope is not as straight anymore, just give it a little snip with your pliers and insert it through the side of the rope and just keep pushing it through until you reach the other side. If you use a twisted rope like this yellow one, all you need to do is just make a little opening for your wire and you just sort of weave it through. With the metal wire inserted through the whole length of your rope, you're gonna make the bunny ear shaped again. And as you can see, I'm holding the rope in place with some clothes pegs, make it a bit easier. And then with needle and thread, you're gonna stitch the rope through the hairband. I also stitched the base of the ears together a little bit to get a nice shape. The end of the rope, you're gonna make a little bit neater by wrapping thread around it. And just put a little bit of glue on the ends to keep the thread in place. So here are both of the hairbands done and now comes the fun part, we're gonna decorate with flowers. Pull the flower heads off the branches. If the flowers won't come loose, just snip it loose with your pliers. And then with your glue gun, attach them to the hairband. I like starting with the big flowers and adding little flowers around the big ones. You can use as many flowers and leaves as you like. I'll just add a few big ones on top with the little ones around it. And I'm finishing off with the teeny tiny flowers on the ear itself. So here you go, your bunny shaped floral head crown. Extremely cute does Kiki look with her bunny ears? Oh my god, it is absolutely adorable and I think I might have to make a matching pair for me too. Because yeah, these ears, you can have them on your uh, one-year-old, like Kiki, or for your bigger child. And why not have them for adults too? I think I might have to make a few more for the whole family to wear. All the clothes Kiki's wearing in this video are from childrensalon.com. Have a look on their website for more fashion inspiration and for the photo tutorial of this craft. I'll be back soon with a new video. I really hope to see you then.